Well, hey friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. I'm so happy that you're here for today's video. We are going to continue fall decorating. Last week we started in the kitchen and today we're gonna be in the breakfast nook. We have a couple DIYs that we're gonna be doing that are super simple, very affordable, and I can't wait to show you. And then of course, we'll do some decorating. I wanted to thank our sponsor today, which is Thrive Market. We will be chatting about them in just a little while and I have a grocery haul to share with you you and I'm really excited for it. Okay friends, let's go ahead and jump right into today's video. To start, I wanted to show you a before of this space. So we recently transformed this space back in the spring and I love how it turned out. But the one thing I'll say is that I really miss having shelves to style in our home. We had so many open shelves in our last home and that's something that I just wish we had here. So we're solving that problem. We took all of the gallery pictures down. Don't worry, I am going to use those throughout our home. We are building a beautiful shelf that is so simple. We went to Lowe's, got a one by 10, a raw board, and then added two coats of stain. This is the board with the stain on it. And then I grabbed these corbels from Amazon and I love them. They are antique brass. They are beautiful, full of character, and look so great in this space with our brass fixtures that we already have. Okay, my friends, it is the next day and my shelf is finished. I could not be more excited. I think that it just adds the perfect vintage flair to this room. I am loving that I will have a space in here to decorate. I cannot wait to have a shelf and just to put all my beautiful kitchen things and seasonal decor up here. I love the corbels. I think they were just the perfect choice for this room. I didn't want to go with anything too plain and I also didn't want to go with anything wooden just because we do have the wooden table, wooden chairs, wooden shelf, and I didn't want there to be too many competing woods. Um, so I'm really, really happy with how this turned out. You can customize this to really just make it your taste, but it was such a simple idea and definitely cheaper than going out and buying a shelf this large online or in the stores. If you remember from my last video, we have this beautiful sconce from Magnolia Home right here on this wall that leads into our kitchen. And I just wanted to kind of show you this angle here where you can see the brass um, corbels mixed with just that beautiful sconce. I think that it just is such a pretty combination and I am just so excited. I have a confession before we start decorating this wall and I give you close-up footage. So as I mentioned at the beginning of this video, this upper portion of the wall above our board and batten accent wall was a gallery wall where we had probably like eight picture frames. And we did take those down, of course, to hang our shelf. We puttied the wall to repair the holes from all of the nails, but I have not yet gone through and sanded and then painted over those spots. So if you happen to see some areas that are not perfect, don't worry, I will get around to it, I promise. There's also some scuff marks and things like that from actually hanging the shelf. The way my schedule worked, I just needed to film today and painting hasn't happened. So it's not always seamless, it doesn't always go as planned, but I am in the next couple of days planning to kind of go through the house and do a paint touch up. Um, as you know, we have young kids, we have a dog, although he doesn't really interfere with the walls. We move furniture all the time, so there are scuffs. We live here, and a couple times a year I like to go through the house and just kind of touch things up. So as I'm doing that, I plan on fixing the space. I thought we'd take a quick moment to thank today's sponsor, which is Thrive Market. Thrive Market is an online membership-based grocery store. They are on a mission to make healthy living easy and attainable for everyone. Groceries 
can be so expensive. And I love that with Thrive Market, we can be still getting high quality, good, organic, eco-friendly products and foods, but not breaking the bank. I don't know about y'all, but we get probably 90% of our groceries, household items, personal care items, and such delivered to our home. We are in a season of convenience and having young ones in school and in activities and um, obviously Chad and I both working, it is so nice to be able to just real quickly go through the website, pick out what I want, order it and have it delivered to our home. There's two different membership options of a Thrive Market. You have the month to month, which is $12 a month, or the annual membership, which ends up being $5 a month, but it's billed at $59.95 annually. And this is a huge savings. I highly recommend doing this. You are going to make up this $60 for the year so fast in your savings by just shopping with Thrive Market. When you're shopping through the website, you can add in search terms like dairy-free, paleo, gluten-free, keto, whatever type of dietary restrictions you may have, if you have any, you can actually type that in and it will filter through all of the different groceries and options and provide you with foods that meet your dietary needs. Thrive Market's products are always changing so there's always something new and exciting to try out which I love and their products also have customer reviews on them on the website so you can check and see what other people are loving I always find that so helpful when I am doing online shopping especially if there's something that I have never tried before I love to hear what other people are saying all right I'm so excited to dig in so these are the snap pea crisps our kids are obsessed with these and i love it because they are so healthy i usually send these with them in their lunches just as something a little bit salty and crunchy i also am so excited to try these so my kids love the chomps and i think i might have some in here but they are so delicious for protein. Our kids have a snack in the morning at school and um, I always try to have some protein in that snack for them just to help fuel them and keep them going throughout the day. These are the chicken and maple mini sticks and I've never tried these before but they look amazing so I can't wait to give these to my kids as a little snack. I am so excited about this granola. We are huge granola lovers over here and this pumpkin one just felt so fitting for the season. This was actually a free gift a box of 10 chopsticks my kids are gonna eat these up this is a special treat for me I wanted to get some chai tea I've been enjoying tea in the evenings it's just super relaxing and a good way to end the day I am so excited to try their creamy peanut butter this is the Thrive Market brand I haven't tried this one yet but we are big peanut butter lovers over here and on that note this is our absolute favorite organic protein powder. The brand is Orgain and we have the vanilla and the chocolate and we're obsessed but I thought we'd try the peanut butter. I'm always making my kids peanut butter smoothies and so I thought this would be just a great addition to our pantry. Then I have a couple of items that were breakable and I love how Thrive Market is just very intentional with their packaging just to make sure that these items got to me safely. We are big pasta lovers, so I grabbed two of the roasted garlic sauce from Thrive. This is their brand, and I'm so excited to try it. We usually have the Rayos, but this was way more affordable, so I thought we would give this one a go. And last but not least, it is pumpkin season, and I got two containers of 
pumpkin we need to make pumpkin bread pumpkin muffins all the pumpkin things and so i'm excited to have these on hand check out thrive market at the link in my video description or visit thrivemarket.com backslash house and home where you'll get 30 percent off of your first order as well as a free gift valued up to 60 dollars you'll also get free shipping on orders over $49 and the membership options are so affordable. So make sure that you don't miss this opportunity. Sign up for Thrive Market today and I'd love to hear what you end up grabbing. Thanks again Thrive Market for sponsoring today's video. Whenever I am decorating a space, I love to pull all the decor that I think might work and just set it all in a nice big pile, lay it out on a rug or maybe on a table like this. So I wanted to show you all the items that I have collected for my shelves. I have a couple of picture frames. I love these, they're both actually from Target. I've had for a very long time. And I am going to be replacing the photos with something a little bit more just moody not necessarily fall but I want to add those deeper darker moody tones I love this egg print and then this kind of European style print as well I think that's so beautiful I just had those printed at Walgreens and they are from the Etsy shop called heirloom print shop so I will link them down below if you'd like to check them out but they're running a sale right now on the day that I'm filming this, and they usually run sales quite often, so I'm just gonna swap those prints out. I've got this stack of plates that I purchased at Goodwill. I usually have these styled either on my kitchen counters or just in my kitchen cabinet. Sometimes we use them for actually eating, sometimes they're just decor. I also have this beautiful antique bowl. I got this one, I believe at the depot. The only issue is that, as you can tell, it's got a crack. So sometimes I'll put fruit in here, but today I think I'm gonna end up putting this up on our shelves. Then I do have some stems from Threshold. These are just like wheat stems. They're really pretty and I thought that they went really well with a wreath that I'm gonna be putting in this space. So I decided to grab those and we're gonna probably put those in a vase that I am going to DIY in today's video. And then I also have this beautiful vase from Hobby Lobby. I love this one. They actually sell it in this size and then in a smaller size, and it's just a nice vase. I love the distressing to it. It's very rustic and great for shelf decor. This was a purchase from last year. I shared this in my um, decor haul for fall this year where I went through my storage closets and I have two of these. This is the large size and then there was also a small. The tag is still on there. So it was $10 last year. I haven't been in Target in quite some time but I think that they, I think I saw someone share that they're selling those again this year. I also have two of these beautiful antique brass candle holders that we are going to be using. I also have my LED taper candles. I shared these in my kitchen fall decorating video and last year I've had these forever. Um, but I'll link them down below for y'all if you want to check them out. They are seriously amazing. They just take batteries and then you can turn them on and off. And they just make our house so cozy and I don't have to worry about the kids knocking them over or forgetting to blow them out. They're just a great safe option if you have kids or pets or just don't wanna have to worry about it. This cutie pumpkin was a Hobby Lobby find this year and I just love it so much. It was $24.99 but then either 40 or 50% off. I can't remember, I went a few weeks ago but I do have a video on that if you are dying to know. I also have this Soul of the Home book and this one is so good. I love flipping through this but I've had it out on our coffee table for quite some time, so I thought that maybe I would take the cover off, which is what I did, and I am just like so happy because it's so pretty, super neutral, and I think it's gonna look really pretty on our shelves, but this is one of my favorite decorating books just to flip through. There's so many beautiful pictures from just decorating ideas, design, 
exteriors. It is just such a gorgeous book. So I will try to link this one for y'all as well. But I want to show you the vase that I am planning to DIY in this video. And then we'll start decorating our new shelves. This is my home goods vase that we are going to be painting here in just a moment. It was only $24.99 and really reminds me of that European jug look for less. realized that I never showed you guys that I moved this rug in here. So this was in our office. I purchased it on Prime Day and it's one of the Lalloy rugs from Amazon. It was super affordable. I think I got it for like a hundred bucks, but I ended up bringing it out here because I wanted a little bit of a larger rug and I love it. You will get to see our office before too long, I promise. And um, the rug that was in here is now in the office and it's just the perfect fit. Now we're gonna make over this European jug that I purchased from Home Goods. I'm using a chalk paint that I bought off of Amazon. It is a very creamy white and I love chalk paint because you don't need to have a primer. You can just get going with your project. Y'all, I did not even use a paintbrush. I found some sponges that I had in my little craft cabinet and just thought, let's go with what I have. This was the quickest little project. I ended up going in with two coats of this chalk paint. I wanted more of a matte finish, so I did not end up adding any sort of wax or glaze to it. You can if that is your preferred look. Now, what I will say is that it did end up being pretty white. I obviously knew that going in with white chalk paint. I do have some really pretty deep dark brown and black acrylic paint. I'll just be honest, I was in a time crunch and I didn't have time to play around with adding dimension and textures. I think that I will revisit this and that I will end up doing that at some point, but I am happier now with how the vase looks than I was when I started. It just really competed with the table and the different shades that I had going on in the table. And so I'm happier with it now. And I think that's all that matters.
much for watching today's video. Don't forget to subscribe. Shockingly, like 42% of people who watch my channel are subscribed, which means there is a big percentage out there um, of y'all that are tuning in that are not subscribed. Subscribing is free and it helps my channel so much. Plus, I would just love to have you as a part of my YouTube family. If you turn on that red notification bell, again, totally free, it will alert you every time I have a new video or I post in the community tab. So definitely something that would just mean the world to me if you enjoy watching my channel. Don't forget to check out Thrive Market. Join today and you will receive 30% off of your first order as well as a free gift valued up to $60. My link thrivemarket.com backslash house and home will be linked down below. Okay, friends, I will see you on the next one for some more fall decorating. Have a wonderful day.